So anyway, I have a grill pan heating over here. That looks good. So should I cover this? Yeah, because you know what? We'll just when we put it into our final serving dish, we can make sure it's okay. it's nicely mixed together. So hopefully this is just gonna easily oh, yep. Beautiful. Ooh, and a nice little piece here for me too. Yum. Mmm. Oh gosh, that is amazing. All right. So all I'm doing is cutting some peaches up. And this is the simplest little dessert. And there's something about grilling the peach really caramelizes the sugars. But what I like to do is just get a little bit of olive oil on one side of the peach. Now, Calder, you can go and get our pork, and if we're lucky, it is so tender Ooh. and beautiful that you'll be able to actually shred it. So, blazing hot grill pan, a little bit of olive oil here. Just get some right here in a dish is how I like to do it. Because you don't need much, oops, excuse me. And just put a bit of it like that, get it onto the grill, and that's it. The oil just prevents it from sticking too much, and it also helps really add a beautiful little glaze to it. Right into a bowl, and while they're steaming hot, you just need a little bit of ice cream right on top. If you want to move on to the ice cream, you can move on to the ice cream and peaches, but I'm going back to the pork sandwiches because I can't even talk now until I get back to them. Thanks for watching. Hungry for more? Click here for more great recipes. And to subscribe, click here. Check back every week for more craveable recipes. Leave a comment and tell me what you think. And don't forget, head over to our other channels for Everyday Food with Sarah Carey, Martha Stewart Weddings, and the Martha Stewart Channel.